Hi guys, this is Thunder E from Board of Work, and I'm going to show you how to record gameplay on your Xbox One using the Game DVR and Upload Studio. So, uh, like the PS4, you can record your gameplay and you can share it. Unlike the PS4, you can't, you don't have a button on your controller to record your gameplay. You have voice controls you can actually use. So there are two ways to do that. The first one uh, records about a thirty minute, uh, sorry, a thirty second clip uh, by saying Xbox record that, and usually that takes once it takes place 30 seconds uh, or say 15 seconds from uh, after the fact you mentioned record that so 50 seconds before and 15 seconds after you get a full 30 second clip now you can edit that and upload which we'll show you in this video the second one is to use the game uh, the game dvr which allows you to record up to five minutes of gameplay uh, so let's try out the first uh, step here just using the uh, the 30 second clip we're playing call of duty ghosts See what we have here. Here are my guys. Switch weapons. And I can say, Xbox, record that. And it records a 30 second clip. I can try to do it again. Xbox, record that. I should record a 30 second clip. It just you just have to enunciate it uh, properly. Now I can also record a longer gaming session by saying Xbox Snap Game DVR. Now that brings up the game DVR and that the game's paused. You can see it recorded the clip earlier. So we have that. Now we can now either edit a clip or record a longer session. So let's go ahead and start new clip. And it allows us to record up to five minutes. So we do about five minutes of gameplay. Once we're done with this, we'll show you how to edit an upload. And then uh, you guys can check it out on YouTube. So we're going to start recording. And then you have to use the command Xbox. You have to use the commands. Stop listening. So this is the part you keep having issues but you have to use the command switch to switch over from the game dvr to your game so you go so you start recording xbox switch that switches me back to the game and i can start foolish of me
Now, is this snapping to target when you move down the sights? Yeah, pretty much. Oof. Cool. All right, so that's we have five minutes of gameplay captured. You can check it out at borderwork.com. Now, when you capture um, a game, you should be able to uh, edit it and upload it. It will upload it to so people can view on Xbox and um, stop listening. And also it will save it to your SkyDrive. So stop listening. So you can actually access it that way. Xbox Switch. So now let me show you how to actually edit uh, your video. So you can go in, you can either start a new clip End clip now, show my clips. And you can decide to keep either the last 30 seconds, 45, or all the way down to a minute. So we keep, uh, sorry, five minutes, I said a minute. So we keep the last five minutes of our gameplay. Now this is added to your clips. So you can now go to show my clips, which brings up Upload Studio. Now Upload Studio allows you to edit this video clip and, um, and also add a few things to it and um, upload it uh, online. Xbox on Snap. All right, so these are all the clips I have taken so far. And this is the last clip I just took five minutes ago, which of course was a five minute clip, so I can actually uh, go ahead and go into the clip. I can actually watch the clip if I want to. Just taking some time there to watch. All right, there we go. So we can actually watch the clip itself, or we can decide to edit it. Now to edit the clip, all you have to do is hit the menu button now bring you options to play the game, edit clip, or delete. So we're going to edit. Continue editing current clip, create a new clip. I already rendered and uploaded a clip already, so I'm going to create a new one. And you can see that previous clip was saved to SkyDrive. So that brings you to the Upload Studios editing page. You start editing. You can just trim it if you want. You can do picture in picture. What that means is that if I click on picture in picture, this will, I put the clip down and then I can actually go in, sit down with connect as I'm doing right now. I record and talk about, for about five minutes and uh, show you basically what I'm gonna do, what I did during the game gameplay session and things like that. But we're not gonna do that, so 
we're going to go back, hit OK, and we're just going to trim. Now you do have other options there, and, and the options are pretty much self-explanatory. In trim, I can just go back in here. I can either take the clip I had, or again, I can use any other clip I want to in my selection. Call of Duty. I can record a voiceover uh, using the headset, or I can add a skin. And you can pick from a few skins here. We have night vision, shards, shapes, frames. I go night vision. Night vision is a good choice. Night vision. So that puts a skin around it. And uh, finish. Now, finish very simple. We enter the name of the clip. We'll call this, um, let's call it what? Let's call it GH. Sample S A M two. Yeah, sample two. We are done. A tag for it. We'll call it Epic Moments. And upload. Now that gives you a, a, a ability to upload directly, and this will now it says it will go to Xbox Live, so your friends can watch it and view. Uh, and also your followers, or you can upload as well as save to SkyDrive. So I'm going to upload and save to SkyDrive so that more people can view this on YouTube. We'll put the clip on YouTube, and here it will render and, and upload. So once it gets to 50%, that means it's done rendering, and then from 50 to 100, it's uploading at that point. Um, and it does a pretty decent job. I'll say it probably takes about 10 to 15 minutes or so. For, for the whole rendering upload process. And uh, that's pretty much it. Now, if you want to view it, of course, you can go back to your uh, game DVR and watch your clips, or you can also check it out on your SkyDrive. It should be in your SkyDrive there with whatever title you've named the clips. So that's pretty much how it is to uh, record gameplay, upload, and share your gameplay on the Xbox One. Uh, if you guys have any questions or any comments about this, let us know. And don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube. It's all Border Work with Two O's. This is Thunder E saying thank you and always enjoy entertainment.